back everybody to Eternal Isles. My name is Gamers101 and my name does not change, at least from what I know. And uh, another update here from the Twitter of the developer of this mod. He said that pretty much all the mobs are nerfed to be in like vanilla Minecraft standards. So all mobs won't be OP, so that's gonna be nice in the next update. So once that comes out, we're definitely doing a switch to it. Because some of the mobs do hit a little bit hard, but I finally figured out our next step of what we are doing here. And I've also been gathering up stuff so we can uh, make this archer gun. So let, let us not make the archer gun, but make arrows for the archer gun. Hunting down all them chickens. Bam, alright, so we got 40, uh, 41 arrows plus a stack of 64. So, we need to get this, the explosive idol, because the next boss we are going to fight is King. Bam, bam, bam. And, ooh, what is this? Blood drainer. That weapon looks really cool. Doombringer. There's a lot of cool weapons here. We can't make any of them. Those are all drops. But, uh, Ember Staff. Hold on. Let me just take a look at these. Oh, and I also have the Tangle Staff. I finally got one. And, uh, we're probably not going to use it because we were going to use it on, uh, Corallus. But he's pretty hard to fight, from what I read on the wiki, at least. But, we need the Explosive Idol. And to get the Explosive Idol, there is a mob we have to fight. I don't remember the exact name of the mob. Uh, maybe I can find it here. Teradonda, Sorrow Sword. Uh, I don't know. It might be a Spinalidon, or an Iosaur, or a Teradon, or one of, one of these many dinosaurs. But we are going to the prehistoric pre prehistoric dimension, aka the Precacia. I think it's Precacia. Precacia? Yeah, it's the Precacia dimension. Precacia, whatever the fuck you want to call it. Uh, we're going to that dimension. There's a Voidwalker down here. I feel like I should kill it. Oh, this ghost. Never mind. I don't really want to go down there. But it spawns in the dun in the not that dun spawns in the jungle. This little thing, and I got lucky to just find it looking down this ravine. And uh, pick those up. That looks extremely hard to mine. But the portal is right down here. I don't know how we get out of here. Uh, I guess we gotta put more ladders again now. But here we go into the pre precaution dimension. Looking for a dinosaur in this underground dungeon or something like that. Because they dropped the explosive idol of the dinosaurs themselves. Also pretty explosive. So uh, I'm kind of scared to see what this what this place has. Oh my god. The amount of mobs there is already. Jeez Louise, man. Damn, this guy has some cool looking wood in here. So this is actually my first dimension I've been to. The, oh. That airplane. It's my first dimension I've been to because uh, when I messed around with this model a long time ago, I did not go to any dimensions. Actually, I might have went to the Haven dimension. Ooh, this wood's pretty cool. Oh, I actually have our house schematic set up. And uh, right here, oh, wrong one. This one right here, house. Don't worry about tits. Tits is not just a test. Uh, I didn't feel like putting tests, so I put tits. So we need to find an underground thing and something something I don't know the name of it but it's an underground dungeon of some sort oh this, there's acid on the floor thanks to these fucking slugs I don't know if they're hostile I'm gonna go on a hunch and say that they are hostile yeah he's hostile he's hostile he's hostile he's about to get fucking wrecked he's about to get wrecked you hostile piece of shit weak weak we might have, have some friends out there the oh there's a fucking there's a saber tooth tiger coming at me there's a fucking saber tooth holy shit Oh, man, that's pretty insane. Okay, uh, we're gonna go to our latest death because we need to set a waypoint on that fucking, on the portal. So, oh shit, can we not have this please? Oh, this is not fun. Uh, fuck you up. Okay, well, we need a portal. Oh, the portal? The portal? <laughs> All right, uh, we'll put one on the portal. Holy shit, waypoint, new waypoint, uh, portal. Okay, good enough. That's close enough. I don't want to go over there and fight that fucking saber tooth as you saw. Oh my god. He actually destroyed my armor really good. Really, really good hitting. He hit so fucking hard. Okay. Now, we need to find this underground thing. So, we'll be trying to go down underground these caves. This looks like obsidian. Oh. Please no. <laughs> Please no more saber tooths. Okay. So we need to just check out any underground area and see if we can find... Oh man, there's been a fucking slug down here. I'm okay with the slugs. They're not as bad as uh, not as bad as that saber tooth or any of the other mobs which I haven't fought yet. But I'm scared. 
The slug is the weakest. I'm extremely scared to fight the strongest. And we're probably right now, we're probably looking for the strongest right now. Let's see if we can just get away from that saber tooth. Okay. Oh, uh, we'll use this block. We'll probably, probably need the moonshiner. Okay. Fuck. Don't tell me we have to go down there. Right, where you at, you fucking saber tooth? What? How come it's not shooting? It's not shooting. Moonshiner, please. Oh, there we go. I don't want to use the archer gun. Oh, ooh. What is this? What is this? Come on, come on, come on. What is this? Precation gems. Where are these used for? Are those used for trading? Those might be used for trading. Which is gonna be nice. There's some traders in this game, in this mod. You can trade with them, obviously, because they're traders. Uh, and they get you some pretty good stuff. I don't really exactly know what they get you, but it has to be good because you have to go to another dimension just to get the gems for them. Which, uh, in my, like, thinking here, I feel like those shits have to be pretty good if you gotta go to a deeper dimension. So I'm looking on the mini-map here, and I'm trying to find what happens if I do this. Nope, oh, that's considered neutral. <laughs> I don't think there's many neutral mobs in here. But I'm looking on the main map, seeing if I can spot the mob we are looking for. He kind of has like a weird black mane or so, of some sort. I don't really know what it is, really. But, uh, we will hopefully be able to find him down here. Okay, the slug, I'm completely okay with fighting. Easiest one. So if we run into some slugs down here, I'll brawl. But if we run into some saber tooths, I'm fucking running. I'm getting the, getting the fuck out of here. How did we go from slug to saber tooth that's extremely fast and strong? Like, what the fuck are you? You are hostile. Fuck you. <laughs> I didn't expect it to be hostile. Usually you're just sitting there. Dire horn. Creeping up behind me. Oh, here we go. We found an ore. We found an ore. Leg fragments. Oh, totes, man. I want some leg fragments. What the fuck are leg fragments? Can we make armor out of these? Oh, please tell me. <gasps> Food is not required. We don't even need food. What do we need, though? Skull bone and foot bone. Oh, shit. Skeletal ingot. Uh. Whoa, hold up. This is only made to make that one piece of armor. <laughs> well, what about this? This is used to make a helmet. This is used to make that. What the hell is made to make the chest plate? Chest fragments? I'm guessing chest fragments. Now, hopefully we can find all of these fragments we need to make that armor in the caves and not have to fight something that goes by the name of skeletal army which is a very hard boss it's like a wave of bosses kind of like terraria has the waves of the little boss fights and shit like that but i, I, just, I just want some i want to i want some easy armor that doesn't need me to spend three hours mining for jade ingots because that, that would be nice and easy if i can get that luxury. Alright, we're gonna go this way. See if we can find some more of this ore. I'm probably gonna have to do some off-camera shit, which I am used to already. And, uh, see if we can find these motherfuckers down here. These explosive motherfuckers. And, uh, I will see you guys in a bit. Actually, no. Let's... Oh, God, it's gonna be nighttime. Let me place that back in front of Oh! Oh! Wait, no! Jesus fucking fuck. This six saber too. Tiger's here. Can't sleep. Can't sleep here. Can't sleep here. Oh, this is bullshit. <laughs> Bruh, let me fucking sleep. I ain't dealing with this shit. You can't sleep. God damn it. So, uh, to survive nighttime, I've resorted to, uh, well, to survive in general, I've resorted to traveling by trees. It's actually not that bad because you never run out of platforms, but I also found this temple. But this is not what we need to find, but I am going to waypoint it. Oh, damn, there's like three of them right next to each other. I am going to waypoint these temples uh, just because... Well, frame drops here. Just because these things are probably going to be useful to us in the future. I think there's a special mob in here. We'll go, uh, I believe they're called Kai, Kai, Kaiyu Temples. 90% sure that's what they're called. Alright, there you go, boom. There's like three of them right next to each other, it's pretty insane. So, I actually fought this thing called like the Terror, Pterodon, Pterodon, Pterodon. Terror? Terror, Pterodon, Pterodon, yeah, there we go. And it was like a, it looked like a, what's the name of that, Triceratops. 
I think that's what it's called. It looked like a Triceratops, and it kept on changing colors. It went from, like, defense stance to where you can't hit it to, like, offense stance to where uh, you can hit it. And it was really weird. And I picked up Heavy Boulder, and I picked up Precacia Gems. Don't know what a Heavy Boulder does, but hopefully that's useful in the future. Probably. Uh, frame rates is dropping, so I'll be right back once we find this underground den. Yo, I think I might have found something. I found skeletal bricks here, and I thought this would be, like, a portal out of the dimension if you like lost your original portal but i think we found something a little bit more crazy than that as you see on the main map there's multiples of them and this might be the underground den and i had to go underground and use the cave mini map holy fuck what are these biosaurs how hard do they hit oh not that hard okay well moonshiner still doesn't work i don't know oh my god what is he regenning off of? what the fuck they regen? This is... Why? Yo, I got, I got my phone right here. I'm about to look up Eternal Isles Iosaur. So, yeah. We're looking for something called the Diocus. And that, that's the dude who drops the explosive idol. And uh, he's found in these underground dens. Now, I know what they look like. I don't... I couldn't really find an entrance to it. But I just started hearing noises. And I just dug... dug, dug all the way down. And, uh... With the cave mini map, I was able to find this. Uh, okay, let's see. Let's read their Eternal Isle description on the wiki here. <clears throat> the Iosaur is an aggressive mob that spawns in a precation underground den. It is a melee mob which regenerates health very rapidly, about 30 health per second. It also has knockback in its name. It's impossible to kill them unless you have a very high damage output and constantly hit it. What the fuck? It's impossible to kill them. The fuck? This is bullshit. Yeah, I don't hit hard enough to kill these motherfuckers. But it's nice to know that we did find something here. Uh, maybe I can, like, come back here. How about, let's do this. Let's do this. Waypoint. Let's go. New waypoint. Io. Soar. Den. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and explore around. See. Explore around. See if I can, uh, see what's in these other dens. I'm gonna start heading to this one, actually. And, uh, because I, I know I... I, I want to kill one of these guys, but it seems like near impossible to kill them right now with the low damage we do. So I'll be right back once again. We'll go to this other dungeon. Okay, so the other one that was next to the, uh, what was the name of the other one we just went to? The other one next to the Iosaur Den, that was just another Iosaur Den. Uh, uh, that was a waste of my time, but I finally found another one. And they go by the name of uh, Spinely Dons. I think I don't know. I can't exactly see their name. We want to move this thing to the bottom left now, which we will do. Uh, but, okay. Uh, yeah, spine, spine only on. And they, lucky for us, they don't do 8 million damage. Which is, well, they don't regen 8 billion health, which is nice. But they do a lot of damage. But they have a chance to drop a gun here. Let's see if we can get that gun. Uh, but it's called like the squad gun or something like that. Yeah, squad gun. Hold down fire to toggle automatic spray. Double click to turn off spray. Insanely fast speed has a 50% chance to not consume ammo. 10,000 uses remaining. I don't know what the ammo is. Is there ammo? Is there a bullet? No, there's no bullets, so... I don't really know what the ammo is. But! Uh, did we still haven't found the ones we were looking for. And I don't see any more dens from this level. Ooh, there might be one. But, uh, at least these guys are killable. They don't, they only do damage when you're low on health. So lucky for us, we're not low on health. That is not what I meant to do. But whatever. These blue bricks take way too fucking long to destroy. I don't know why I'm using them to, like, block off and stuff. But let's see if we can get, a advantage on him and drop on him. Drop on the fuck! Let's see if we can get an advantage on him. If we can drop to the floor... Take damage. All right, good. This is good. Advantage for us. Oh my god, we got an advantage for once. Yeah, I can't wait for the next version though, because uh, those nerfs, those uh, buffs, uh, nerfs, not buffs, they will be really good for me, because that means I don't have to deal with mobs being extremely OP. But uh, yeah, just, just can't wait for the update. But until the update comes, we're gonna have to be on the grind doing this stuff. Uh, I will do one more jump cut and hopefully we will find 
dinosaur we are looking for, whatever the fuck it's called, Deca Diana, Dena Decasaur. What an adventure! And it took way too damn long for us to find our destination in this adventure. But uh, I also found a skeletal arena. That's nice. It's gonna happen in the future, but we finally found him, Diocus. Diocus. Ninety percent sure they explode and in here, which is uh, not very nice. I just, just wanted to test that out there, and indeed they do poison you. But uh, see if we can just open up a little bit more here. Now, the question is, do they explode when you hit them? They do not. Thank God for that. That could have made this fucking sh you know, made this farm in a nightmare. And I did farm those uh the other dudes, the orange dinosaurs, for a long time, but they didn't drop jack shit. Which is dumb because I killed like 50 of them. Besides uh, vacation gems, hopefully we'll be able to put those uh, gems to use. Explosive item. We already got one. I might go on peaceful. I'm going on peaceful just for. I'm sorry. It needs to be done. It needs to be done. This is what we came here for. This is where our adventure is finally gonna end. Oh my God! Thank, thank the Lord. We have found it. Okay, I'm not gonna. Yeah, I'm not gonna light up the whole area. It can be cheap like that actually. But I will be cheap enough. To just grab the explosive idol and then drop back inside and and to go ahead and put it back on normal. Thank the Lord. Thank you guys. Bless you. Bless your soul so much. Before we end off the episode though, I am going to check what else they can drop and see what they uh, what else they drop is useless useful. Let's see if I can get on the camera. They have a chance to drop a power ray? Wait, what <laughs> power ray? Yo. Oh, they have a chance to drop that? Oh my god. Alright, I might have to add in uh, extra utilities or whatever the fuck the name of that mod is. And I uh, set up a farm with these guys because they have a chance to drop a power rate and a precation upgrade kit. Now the precation upgrade kit sort of it upgrades weapons, we can tell. And uh, it doesn't do anything to the power ray. But very cool that they can drop a freaking ray gun. Let's actually see if we can kill one more. Let's see if we can get that ray gun something here. Come on, man. Come on, man. When you guys gotta die? I probably shouldn't waste arrows like that. I should probably save the arrows for uh, Bam Bam Bam. Which is, I like King Bam Bam, but uh, he's got three Bams in his name, so I gotta say King Bam Bam Bam. Alright. Did you guys drop anything of use? Of use? You are stuck in the floor. Uh, let's not do that. Is that another explosive vital? Yeah, it is. Alright, so I'll see you guys in the next episode of Eternal Isles, where we will make our way to another Hopefully we'll have some new armor. I don't know. I might have to get some more of this shit. But uh, I will see you guys in the next episode of Eternal Isles. King Batman, man.